pizzazz, perks, everything. Look, we got these. Don't even worry about it. How high you trying to get? Shit, nigga, get, get five, take pop six, nigga. You gonna run with me, dude. Fuck you, man. It's wherever you want to take it. And it's natural. You ain't gonna overdose. It helps your, your reproductive system. You gonna breathe better than everything, nigga. You hear me? And it's gonna be sold on my side like that. I'm gonna sell them bitches two for 15, three for 25, six for 15. <laughs> Six for 50, 12 until the bitches go in jail. Cause they gonna buy the bitches and once they see they work, all the shorties gonna take them back to the hood. It's gonna be over with. So I'm trying to do. Three for 25, three for the, heavy on the, heavy on the, what, hey, what you got, eight? Hey, you got eight? Hey, you got eight? Hey, shit, come on, shit, come on. I ain't gonna give you no big one cause you got eight. Hey, you only got eight, hey, nigga, so you finna get the smallest one. There you go, boom. Cause you only had eight. Hey. You got 10? Okay, you got the whole 10. I'm gonna get you right. You got, you had the whole 10. But you, six? Well, I'm gonna get your ass a shell. There you go. You gonna think of something that you gonna get home, you gonna be hurt like you hurt me when you came with that six. We can both play them games, nigga. You ain't gonna hustle the hustle, baby. What you get? What you get? What you got, Art? I only got, man, nephew, I, I got, I got 22. You got 22. Well, look, go ahead and keep that two dollars for you because you might need it for later. I'm gonna go ahead and drop that other one in there and get you two. Oh, come on now, if you let me get the three for the 25, I got 22. Nigga, I'm already giving you three for the 25. It's supposed to be 30 dollars. All right, so if you only got 22, you might want to keep that up two out of your pocket because you might need that shit for later. I'm gonna go ahead and drop that back in there. You take these two, give me that 20 dollars. I'll get up with you later. You feel me? That's how we do business out here. You ain't trying to, you ain't go out hustling the hustler. You gave out a slip the slip. So there we go, huh? She took seriously or serious. One thing I'm grateful for, though, you know what I'm saying? One thing I'm grateful for, though, Lord, is my mom. She always claimed me, you know what I mean? Don't get it wrong. She ain't always want me around, you know what I mean? But what stuck with me is when, when you know what I'm saying, when people ask, you know what I'm saying, if she confronted about something, she'll always be like, that's my son. And I'm glad, you know what I'm saying? I'm glad while I was alive, I was able to make you proud and in some form or fashion. Like when I graduated high school, you showed up for that. Back when we played rec league football, you know what I'm saying, for the bum ass, you know what I'm saying, the bum ass football league out there, you know, you was at those games. You was mainly at my brother games though, you know what I'm saying, it was all good, you was still there though, but you was always looking out for your folks, you know what I'm saying, you was always looking out for folks and being available to people in the community. I appreciate your mom, you know what I'm saying, for visiting me when I was locked up in my earlier years. I enjoyed watching those movies with you. And letting us teach you how to play Tony Hawk Underground too. Every time I hear reggae or Spanish music, you know what I'm saying, you come to buy. I remember you was the biggest Ricky Martin fan, and one day on the radio you heard he was gay. You started throwing away all the CDs and live performances that he had on tape. But you kept all those Backstreet Boy tapes and the Tybo tapes for the longest, you know what I'm saying? It was fun doing those little Tybo with you in front of the TV after you got off work. I ain't never forget that, you know what I'm saying? I remember your favorite actors being Matthew McConaughey, and Nicolas Cage. At, you know what I'm saying? As time went on, you became Team Edward from Twilight. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Since my birthday was near Christmas time, it was always, you know what I'm saying? I ain't never really, you know what I'm saying? You won't end up throwing me parties and stuff like that. It was cool. But it was a time, though, like, when I remember when I came back from Falls Care and I know what I'm I just got back into your household. And yeah, it bought me a skateboard and a Jimmy Hendrix shirt for my birthday. You know what I'm saying? Thank you for that. I thank you for forcing me to go to Bible study when I didn't want to go. I remember seeing you and my brother get baptized together, and that made me want to try Christ as a small boy. You know what I'm saying? Finally get out, you know what I'm saying? Now everybody's knocking on my door trying to get me to come outside. Yo, bro, come outside, bro. Like, nigga, I can't, bro. I heard you, like, nigga, look, bro. Like, oh, shit, yo, that shit for real, you know what I mean? Um... Yo, I got some gas, bro. You trying to have like, man, I can't, bro. Like, nigga, I'm on papers, bro. No, man, I got some new gas, bro. Like, this shit called K2, bro. Like, this nigga, this when I first came across Spice, nigga, I was fuck with that Spice a little bit. Nigga, I'm like, yo, let me hit that shit, bro. We'll be a trip off this Spice. Nigga, look at Greg's out that motherfucker. Nigga, I mean, that y'all go, man. Fuck with that Spice, man. You know what I'm saying? Nigga. So, boom, nigga, can't tell Point World, nigga. I'm getting niggas to bring me Spice at the crib, nigga, because I can't go nowhere, nigga. You know what I'm saying? School year about to start back up and get my mom trying to get me back in school, but they ain't trying to let me type of shit. They tell us, something, yeah, you got some online school. We got online classes now, my mom. Like, we don't got no damn internet at the house. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, the teachers was just pretty much bringing me work, you know what I'm saying, in person to the crib. 
You know what I'm saying? And they started messing me, so they started putting in word for me at the school. Like, yeah, we we really miss him in the class. He should come back. He he's not a threat to us. Like he never was a threat, boo boo boo. Oh like, yeah, bro, I never was a threat. You know what I mean? Like, you know, stop messing with these folks, bro. So nigga. Here it is, bro. It was like around July, August time, like school about to start back up. So now I don't fuck with the spice and shit. People still trying to get me to come back outside. So you know me, bro. Like, with my mom at work, you know what I'm saying? Every now and then, like, I'll tiptoe outside to try to see how far I can go. You know what I'm saying? Or, you know what I mean? I sneak some drunks into the crib, bro. I'm hitting the drunks inside the crib while I'm a house arrest, bro. And I'm trying to, like, calculate time. They're trying to sneak these bitches out before this bitch pop up. You know, some shit, you know what I mean? Cause you know what I'm saying? Not only that I can't go outside, nigga, ain't a lot to have visitors type shit, nigga. You know what I mean? And like, you know what I'm saying? My brother at this point, he back from, you know what I'm saying, the Marines type shit. But like I said, he reserves. So like, he was still staying in the house at the point, but he won't pay enough bills and shit like that. Real. Everything was just back to the door for pretty much, bro. So like, nigga... As I'm, like, still fucking with the shit, bro, like, as I'm still, like, sneaking outside on the house arrest type shit, bro, I never realized, I'm like, man, these motherfuckers ain't coming, bro, like, bro, if these niggas will pull up, bro, I'm outside, bro, I don't care, bro, I was one day when I was like, man, I don't care, bro, you know what I'm saying, I'm outside, I spoke my little spice blood, bro, you know what I'm saying, so of course I'm not gonna care, nigga, I'm on a whole other high, bro, so I'm out there joint, bro, and I kept seeing, like, all these yards, bro, like, maybe... It was the K2 trip that was best with me, bro. But I kept seeing everybody yards, bro. Like, everybody yards was just messed up to me, bro. Like, the grass is too high. You know what I'm saying? I kept seeing all these weeds. So, nigga, I just started knocking on everybody. I'm like, do you need your yard cut? You need your yard cut, bro? I ain't even have a damn lawnmower, bro. Lawn cart. You know what I'm saying? Didn't need me grass cut type shit. So, boom. Nigga, here we are, bro. So... I mean, I'm getting these yeses, I'm getting these no's, I'm getting these yeses, I'm getting these, yeses, I'm getting these no's. So I end up, you know what I'm saying, walk around the block one more time. And I started counting all the houses that was saying yeah to me and shit. Then I just walked behind, like, like literally laying out, just like pretty much walking behind like a little small alleyway, like a grassy alleyway. Like, I was just walking like behind houses, bro. Like, it pretty much like I knew who was home and I knew who wasn't home on that summer day, nigga. So, like, I was just walking through the little backyards, bro. And I was just finding, like, these little push lawn boards that was never, like, Fucked with bro Like some of them Jones was like brand new But them niggas was like Them shit was like Never used So it was like grass All caught up in it And shit Cause like grass Had like Grown from You know what I'm saying It's sitting on it For so long type shit Nigga So bro nigga Luckily bro Like It was gases out of the junk And everything nigga So I grabbed somebody Push lawn board bro And I You know what I'm saying Well I borrowed it nigga You know what I'm saying So I'm walking around The neighborhood With the push lawn board of course, my mom pulling up early as usual, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Where you get that lawnmower from? Bring that shit back. And why the fuck you outside? I mean, man, look, yo, like I'm trying to make some money, man. It's the summertime, bro. You know what I mean? My mom was like, I'm calling the cops and I'm talking to your probation. Yo, yo ass getting the fuck out of my house. You don't know how to listen. Boo boo. I'm like, man, look, bro. Like I just said, like, man, I don't care. Like, I just brushed her off, bro. I just kept, like, dragging the day, push lawnmower up the road to, like, the first house that said, yeah, whatever, nigga. So I'm outside, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I'm cranking a bitch up. Cranking a bitch up. You know what I'm saying? She's starting, but nigga, she ain't really like, you know what I'm saying? She ain't biting all the way, nigga. So like, I lift her up. You know what I'm saying? I start pulling out all that extra, you know what I'm saying? Grass and grime and shit out. So now she pulling over, nigga. I finally got her started. I finally got her started. I released the damn, uh, you know what I'm saying? They a little ignition. I released the little gas, you know what I'm saying? Handle shit. Turn it back off. I'm like, all right, cool. As I like, I'm making my way into the yard. Like, I'm picking up sticks and like pop cones or whatever, yo. The little nice lady, you know what I'm saying, came outside with like some Capri Suns. So she had like a little bologna sandwich, bro. You know what I'm saying? A little bologna and mayonnaise sandwich, bro. She came out beside with one of them joints. A little Capri Sun, bro. Next thing you know, bro, two, you know what I'm saying? Next thing you know, bro, two cars pull up, bro. And then damn, two officers hop out. Come here, come here, come here. You know, niggas, them, them motherfuckers done start chasing me around and this type of shit, bro. The lady was outside. I was like, what did he do? What did he do? You know what I'm saying? My black hair, bro, I should have just fucking around and just left, bro. Just took off running wherever, bro. Just outrun these niggas. But me, bro, I'm trying to, like, you know what I'm saying? Stand, these, stand this lady, y'all. Because I'm thinking, like, you know what I'm saying? If they see, you know what I'm saying? If they see 
me with the lady in the damn fucking lawnmower all together, then hopefully they'll know, like, all right, boom, I'm the wrong dude or whatever. But, like, nah, bro, like, these dudes are trying to get me, bro. You know what I'm saying? Eventually they end up catching me and they open me up or whatever. He was like, yeah. Didn't we fucking tell you? Didn't we fucking tell you? And the lady was like, what did he do? What did he do? You know what I'm saying? That's why I remember vividly from that shit, bro. That lady kept asking me what I did. And, like, please tell me what he did. You know, and the mother like, threw me in the back of the damn jump, bro. And the niggas was like, yeah, so you running away from home now? You running away from home? Look at this motherfucker. Like, what are you talking about, bro? Like, yeah, your mom told me everything that you running away from home now and you trying to live with the local drug dealer. And I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about, bro? Like, nigga, I was only trying to goddamn, you know what I'm saying, cut some yards this morning. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? They was on some shit like, yeah, we got to come to your house again. I'm bringing DP with me and it's going to be me and you. I'm like, what the fuck? Nigga, fuck you and DP, bro. So, boom. Nigga. Not only that, bro, my damn P.O. was at the house, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? These niggas dropped me off. My mom standing outside smoking the cigarette, started going off. It's like, see, this is the shit I'm talking about. You getting fucking dropped off in my house, and you supposed to be on, you know what I'm saying? My mom was going, I am. You know what I'm saying? Trying to make a scene in front of P.O. or whatever. Nigga, the damn P.O. I had goddamn extended my damn house arrest shit. And then she was on some shit. I was like, yeah, if I have to come out here again, da 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 you know what I'm saying? Talking that little dumb shit. And then, you know what I'm saying, they piss test me or whatever, they ain't find nothing, because, you know what I'm saying, I'm smoking spice all that time, bro, you know what I mean? So, you know what I'm saying? You good boy. Yeah. Hey, hey, good boy. Red on the Good boy. Sit, boy. Uh. Uh. Got you this. Uh. Sit, boy. Sit. Sit. You know what I'm saying, man? It's like, yeah, yo, so like me, we over here. I'm begging this nigga so I can keep his bike or whatever, bro. Eventually, he ended up letting me keep his bike because he came across another bike that his friend had gave him, which was way faster than mine, man. So now, I don't want that junk because he talking shit like, man, my bike way better. Anyways, so like, <laughs> I'm telling the story. Hey. Shh, I'm telling the story. Uh, shh. I got eyes. I'm telling the story. Yeah, man, so I was all saying, yo. <laughs> we over there fighting over the bikes and shit. I'm over there trying to take my thing. Be quiet. Sit somewhere. Yeah, man, so we over there fighting over the bikes and stuff, bro. Of course, this nigga get a way better bike than me, man. And I'm like, yo. My mom going ham, because she, like, she see two bikes in the crib. She think I stole the other joint. But my brother like, nah, man. My friend had gave me this one. He's like, well, can I have another one? like, nah, we're going to use it. And I'm like, yo, come on, yo. Like, bro, this nigga got two bikes, bro, and he only one person, yo. And then, and then. So, like, niggas end up stealing this bike anyways. And then she thinking I had something to do with it. I'm like, yo, like, that was y'all niggas get for not letting me have it anyway, bro. Like, hey, I would have kept the eye on it if it was mine. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, boom, yo. Ain't no come across a move. Yeah. Like, you know, so I ain't no come across. <laughs> I ain't no come across some more bikes, you know. And learn how to spray paint them, you know, so I'm spray painting, you know what I'm saying? I got my own little joint. I'm hiding bikes in the cut now. I'm hiding bikes in the cut now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, good boy. I'm hiding bikes in the cut now, you know what I'm saying? My brother over here, he, he hating now because you wonder where I'm getting all these bikes from. You know what I'm saying? I got me a few little home, 
Got me saying, got me a little few little homies running away now who riding bikes, you know what I'm saying? We popping wheels and stuff. And then I see my brother, his little clique, and then he got his little bike, and we talking shit like, man, y'all slow. So now we racing on the bikes or whatever. And you know what I'm saying? We dusting these niggas. You know what I'm saying? Of course, I'm the leader. And my brother, he's salty in the cut. He's just giving me that look like, all right, which we getting ready to help me? Because you can't beat me in the house. You, you beat me outside. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So, boom, we outside. And my mom pulled up from work again. On one of the little early days, nigga, she see us outside. She going ham. You know what I'm saying? So now she taking everything away, yo. Hey, boy. Yeah, now she taking everything away. She taking everything away. <laughs> she taking everything away, y'all. You know what I mean? And then, bro, so we watching my little sister at this point. Mom pregnant again now. All right, so we watching my little sister. We going to school and stuff. You know what I'm saying? We kind of, you know what I'm saying? We kind of still going to my uncle's house on the weekends. But now we mainly going to my own house on the weekends, bro. Like, the one with the two cousins and shit, though. Like, we mainly going to their crib. On weekends and that's you know what I'm saying that's where I'm learning like all the extra shit like all the you know what I'm saying the shit pretty much all the extracurricular shit you know what I'm saying so boom stop boy <laughs> yeah man so like yo as I'm visiting my cousin and shit bro I'm pretty much going back to school and I'm repeating the shit that I'm learning over the weekend you know what I'm saying, to the kids out of school, you know what I'm saying, they learn the new slang and they dress like me and shit. You know what I mean? I'm thinking it's cool, yo, like, I'm thinking everybody, you know what I'm saying, shit is just what it is, bro. You know what I'm saying? That was in the more, yeah, that was in the more. Stop! <laughs> that boy, yeah, man, that was in more, like, busier spot in town than where we was at, you know what I'm saying? So, like, they pretty much had, like, way more shit to do than what we had. All we pretty much did, we just went to the beach, you know what I'm saying? That was all we did, because, nigga, our neighborhood was built on the beach and shit, so, nigga, we just ride out to the beach, or we just, like, play football on the, you know what I'm saying, that little bum-ass football field that was out there. But, you know what I'm saying? After, after a while, man, like, niggas just got tired of playing sports, bro. Like, everybody just drifted off to smoking, bro. Or, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, that was, like, the only way out. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to the area, bro. Like, the only way out that joint is, like, nigga, it's the military, the shipyard of the day. You know what I'm saying? Or you can go to college if you got the money for it. <laughs> Dead the job, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm staying to myself. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting my calls back. I'm finally back on track after, you know what I'm saying, being put back on square one. You know what I'm saying? So... Now, you know what I'm saying, I'm pretty much studying to get my wings. We got this little shit where you got to, you know what I'm saying, some military shit. I ain't trying to get into all that explaining shit. But anyway, like, I'm studying to get my wings or whatever, boom. Got my wings and shit. Mind you, though, like, shorty ended up reaching back, you know what I'm saying? I'm still slipping over this nasty bitch, bro. Like, it's no telling what the fuck she's doing, like. Behind the scenes, but you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm so lonely across seas and shit, bro. Because, like, I don't got no family, bro. Like, she was the only source of, a, like, some type of, like, family, you know what I mean? Including, like, despite those other two dudes that I just described, bro. But, like, after that little, you know what I'm saying, experience with those niggas before going to employment, bro. Like, I had no fucking plans to even talk to those niggas again anyways, bro. So, I was like, man, lo, like, as long as I'm good with this bitch, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, boom, like, nigga. It'd be me and her against the world type shit, but like, bro, she was on some other shit when I was going on leave, bro. Cause you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, I was trying to scoop the bitch, nigga, so we could go on a fucking road trip, nigga, all the way back. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was gonna be a good time, you know what I'm saying? But like, nigga, took the bitch back with all the deployment and shit, bro. I continued to buy more stuff and shower this bitch, you know what I'm saying? I was sitting in this bitch bread and shit, bro. Whole time, bro, like, nigga, turns out, bro, like, can you mind you, nigga? Last time I seen the bitch, bro, like, this is how I left the bitch, bro. Like, when I met the bitch, bro, she was a virgin. She was, like, she was, like, a certain way, nigga. Nigga, I took her virginity, nigga. She was still that certain way, nigga. I come back, nigga. Fucking boot camp ain't nothing but, like, two months, nigga. How the fuck you become a... You know what I'm saying? That shit crazy, bro. Like, but this bitch, like, super thought, bro. Like, this shit crazy, nigga. So, like, all these random people started hitting me up. 
when I was like on the pub and shit, nigga, was asking me like, hey, man, is you Mud? Ask me my name and shit. I'm like, bro, like, I can see my nigga, my fucking name is Mud, nigga. You see my name, nigga. You see my Instagram, nigga. Like, it ain't hard to tell, nigga. So, bro, had introduced himself to me. Like, it was several dudes, bro. Like, nigga, it was several dudes, nigga. Like, you know what I'm saying? But it was, like, the main two that she was, like, dealing with at the time, though. You know what I'm saying? These niggas was hit me up at different points. You know what I'm saying? Like, one of these niggas was talking crazy. The other niggas, he ain't want no smoke. But the nigga that was talking crazy, though, bro, like, it was all some shit. Nigga, I was ready to take emergency leave just so I could go and piece this nigga up because he was just talking too fucking crazy, bro. But, I, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? So, boom, she ended up, you know what I'm saying, finally broke it to me. It was like, you look, man, like, nobody ain't want you, boom, boom, boom. She was like, she was over with me for the bread, da, 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 whatever the fuck she was saying, you know what I'm saying. So, she would end up choosing the other nigga, boom, you know what I mean. So, you know what I'm saying. I'm in the, you know what I'm saying, I'm feeling bad or whatever, but, you know, so I'm still keeping it gangster or whatever. But, like, at the same time, yo, like, that shit is affecting my work because it's like, yo, bro, like, Bitch, do you understand, like, how much fucking investment I put into you, bro? Like, how much fucking, like, time, like, you wasted. Well, time that I'm wasting, you know what I'm saying? Just by fucking, you know what I'm saying? Trying to see the good in you, bitch. And trying to, like, god dang, you know what I'm saying? Be an actual Christian gentleman, bro. Cause, you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you're supposed to forgive people 70 times over 70 times, bro. But, like, at this point, bitch, you deserve straight death, bro. Like, you just straight, you know what I'm saying? You don't disrespect me like that, bro. Fuck wrong with you, bro. But anyway, back to the story, nigga. Okay, cool. <laughs> Nigga, so like, nigga, I'm stuck with all these fucking gifts, bro. Like, nigga, the gifts that, like, I'm stuck with, bro. Like, just straight designer shit, bro. Like, it's like all types of shit, bro. Like, nigga, rafts, dolls, cloud, and nigga. Supreme was high, so I had, like, a shitload of Supreme at the time, bro. Like, around that time, nigga, I was Supreme mud. So, like, nigga, everything that I wore was Supreme, nigga. I was just on some, like, Supreme patty type shit, nigga. You know how I mean, how it is, nigga. Like the moniker was on the Supreme, nigga. Till I made my own shit, you know what I'm saying, like, nigga. Boom. So like, yeah. No, only I got all these gifts, bro. Like, nigga, I end up buying a ring for this bitch, bro. You know what I'm saying? That shit crazy, nigga. So like, I'm stuck with all this stuff, bro. And like, I'm trying to figure out what the fuck I'm gonna do with all this stuff, bro. So my dumb ass end up taking the bitch back, bro. Just to find out, like. That bitch nasty, bro. Like, we gonna get to it in the next episode. Possibly, nigga. I don't even know if I'm gonna make another episode, nigga. I'm too real for this shit, bro. Like, I'm always outside, bro. Like, I'm ten toes down on this bitch, nigga. I got money to make, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Let that bitch burn in hell with the rest. You know what I'm saying? Like, that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Fuck them niggas. Fuck everybody that ain't with it, nigga. I pray tomorrow don't arrive So I just keep quiet Hoping that you be quiet You see I'm always on my own But I don't think about it Now I'm in my feelings Later on I might dream about it That's if I live right And also while I'm smoking More than often try to live right I used to say I'm only smoking To get my head right Now I'm in my head Attracting these migrants From all these red lights Red lights, green lights You made sure that he was dead right Call out my lawyer I'm making sure That it's a fair fight That means a Freemason And I'm nothing I got my hands tied With my thumbs up Outside as if I hitchhike, third wheel kick bike. I mean a kid bike, murky niggas win pipes when I shape shit that midnight tomorrow won't arrive, it's all a lie. Every day's the same, living life with made up time. I pray tomorrow don't arrive, I'll be fine. Sometimes I wish you really love me, but you just love to waste my time. I pray tomorrow don't arrive. There ain't a guy. You say you believe in God, but here you right in my face, speaking these lies. I pray tomorrow don't arrive. I pray tomorrow don't arrive. So I just keep quiet. Hoping that you be quiet You see I'm always on my own But I don't think about it Now I'm in my feelings Later on I might dream about it That's if I live right And also while I'm smoking more than often Trying to live right <laughs> Minocchio We was in love Still we is apart You can be with God You, me, and the dog you can be with God, see you at the top 64 Impala hitting switches don't stop When you gonna stop? Presidential watch, better pick a spot We need a bigger boat, we need a bigger rock Things up on the block, needin' what I got In your pocket checkin', don't speak on what I got Everybody
Everybody know my face, I'm thinking that you hide Everybody know my name, I'm thinking that you hide We can make it hide, we can get it started We can make it pop, three wheels on them Hitting corners when I ride This is how we ride, this is how we vibe This is how we, this, this is how we vibe Only good vibes, only good times Watching good times, rolling good times Let's have a good time, I'm living good now I'm feeling good now, you know good clown I wish you would now, you never was down You never was black, you never was proud We was in love, still we is apart You can be with God, you, me and the dog You can be with God, see you at the top 64 Apollo hitting switches don't stop We was in love, still we is apart You can be with God, you, me and the dog you can be with God, see you at the top 64 Apollo hitting switches don't stop When he gonna stop? Presidential watch, better pick a spot <laughs> Minocchio some time to heal from that too, yo, because, like, bro, the reason why I joined the Navy, bro, was because of friend, you know what I'm saying, like, you know what I'm saying, eventually a new dude in the mood to my neighborhood, bro, like, he was, like, the friend of all friends, bro, like, you know what I'm saying, like, once when I met this dude, nigga, my grades got better, nigga, like, all that stuff, bro, you know what I'm saying, I won't sit on drugs no more, he was always exercising, so I started exercising with him and shit. And then, like, you know what I'm saying, he would smoke six and I would smoke a weed. So that was, like, a little thing that we will try to, like, you know what I'm saying, motivate each other with. Like, yeah, man, we got to quit this stuff, bro. I'm like, yeah, man, we're going to quit, bro. Like, we're going to quit on the 13th, bro. You know what I'm saying? We'll say shit like that. You know what I mean? And then there was one day, bro, like, this nigga just kept carrying a jug around with this. You know what I'm saying? A jug of water around with him. I'm like, bro, what are you carrying a jug of water around with you, bro? He's like, yeah, man, like, I'm going to go off for the seals, bro, like. I'm tired of all this, bro. I'm about to just go ahead and just leave, man. And you know what I'm saying? I'm like, yo, that's what's up, bro. Yo. Like, I actually was thinking about going to Marines, yo. Like, you know what I'm saying, man? Like, you know what I'm saying? At that point, bro, like my brother had already left. You know what I'm saying? It came back from the boot camp type shit. You know what I'm saying? So when my brother came back from the boot camp, he was all in his uniform or whatever. It was, like, all expiring and shit. And, of course, you know how my mom is. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, shit, man. I'm trying to make my mom that type proud, too, though. You know what I'm saying? So, boom. You know what I mean? Of course, you know what I'm saying? I'm going through shit at my crib or whatever. But, like, nigga, I'm chilling with him, though, bro. Like, nigga, it's as if, like, nigga. You know what I'm saying? It's as if I'm in, like, a whole new world type stuff, bro. Like, nigga, because, you know what I'm saying? He was, type going through some stuff. But, like, he had already overcame shit like that. So, like, he was teaching me, like, how to, like, you know what I'm saying? Have thick skin and, like, how to laugh stuff off. And stuff like that. But you know what I'm saying? Eventually, bro, he just ended up passing away, bro. Like, he just ended up dropping dead literally when I was outside, man. Like, he just came out with him, man. He was dressed up all night. So I'm like, bro, where you about to go? He said, man, I'm about to go out to the mall, man. You know what I mean? He said, I'm about to leave in a little bit. He said, you want to hang out? I was like, yeah, man, we can hang out. He said, hey, man, let's take a picture together, bro. And I was like, oh, shit, man, I ain't got my phone. He said, come on with me, bro. So I let... So come walk with me to my house and get my phone. So we walked down the cut, bro. And he just like caught a brain aneurysm, bro. Outside, bro. He just died on the sidewalk, man. You know what I mean? Like, I remember holding him, bro. Like, you know, the last face that I seen that he seen before he had left this earth, bro. You know what I mean? That stayed with me, bro. Cause it's like, dog, like, 
what if he would have survived, you know, you know what I'm saying? And, like, as he became a Navy SEAL, like, what he would have been a fuck nigga like the rest of these niggas, bro. And that shit bothers me, bro, because, like, to this day, bro, like, nobody can top that friendship that I had with him. M-U-D-N-O-Double-C-H-I-O My Nokia M-U-D-N-O-Double-C-H-I-O My Nokia M-U-D-N-O-Double-C-H-I-O My Nokia M-U-D-M-U-D M U D M U D M U D yeah it's M U D got it out the mud baby look at me looking clean old school whip I'm talking limousine tinted window thought I didn't know the trick is in your sleep look at me like I ain't respond cause I'll get really mean I really mean fuck everybody I got a different scheme watching my shit stop watching my shit bitch you can't stick with me look at you niggas look at me on your TV screen full screen last time I seen y'all did not say I'd be on the screen your spells backfire eat a dick I really in these streets fuck the industry like Waka I'm really in these streets day after day Not at the night protecting my energy You wish I was dead All because you wasn't feeling me You wish I was dead All because you wasn't listening But you're listening now Everything y'all did didn't get to me Yeah I know I don't see color but I see a dream That's not a favorite dream I promise don't think it's make believe I make movies and I mind my business I run out dinners and watch my movies And only pay for me I don't play games I make games So tell them wait on me Abigail if you can hit me Wait on me, I got enough on my plate And I ain't ate a week, I haven't cried in some years I need to take a seat, Hey yo, men don't cry Just roll the blunt up, I said Men don't cry, go have some fun or something I got a chip on my soda, I'm talking both of them Blow your shit off in mid-air Like we duck cut and duck the goose On the dotted line, but I ain't butt fucking I'm so cool, in the summertime I'm rocking nut huggers, bitch, I'm who M-U-D, what you want from me? Look at y'all still below me and looking up to me So why the fuck would I hang with a peasant? I got my own money, I just said I got enough on my plate And it's all for me, M-U-D Energy don't lie, I know you envy me Just get off my dick Let me live in peace now, I I feel like a dead nigga stop speaking death on me and even eye on me. Just say you proud of me. I and you see dig. you my Nokia. Yeah, of course, man.